You know if someone says bleeding internally, yeah? That is, means, that, is that a bad thing? Yeah, blood inside. Thing. You can't No, but that's where the blood's supposed to be, though. No, but you're bleeding. Oh my god, he's not. All right, well, oh my god. Oh my god. Have you ever thought about that? Wow, wow, wow. You might have just done something. Listen, you're bleeding entirely. I'll put on you. You have done something. Put on you. You have done something. You've just opened up. No. Had done you. No, no. Why is internal bleeding such a big deal if your blood is meant to stay inside your body? Here's the thing internal bleeding isn't just about blood staying in your body, it's about blood staying inside your blood vessels. So when blood leaks out, whether from trauma or certain conditions, it's no longer reaching vital organs that need it. This means those organs will stop working. Plus, it can create a dangerous pressure effect by pressing on those organs and disrupting their function. Now, picture blood pooling around your heart, lungs or brain. That pressure will very quickly become life-threatening. And because it's hidden, internal bleeding often goes unnoticed until it's severe.